Well, a very warm welcome to the NAF Five Star Hartbury International Horse Trials 4011. NAF, the new title sponsors here at Hartbury, they've been involved with this very popular event for two years, but their first year of title sponsorship. Three levels of competition, the CCI 1 star, the CCI 2 star and R focus, two sections of CIC 3 star. Organiser here, Janet Plant, has done a great job. Eric Winter designs across country and it was four days of great action here at Hartbury College. Here's a quick look at the leaderboard. In the first of our sections, Section C, Andrew Nicholson and Christopher Burton. Of course, went so well, Andrew to win at Gatcombe recently. Christopher Burton was in the top five as well. And Mr. Cruise Control leads, under discussion second. And then three for Britain make up the top five, Sarah Cohen, Zara Phillips and Emily Llewellyn. I'm joined by Mark Todd, who was competing here at Hartbury. Good afternoon, Mark. Good afternoon, Ed. Uh, looking forward to this cross-country section. An exciting competition coming up. And Mark, 26 fences on Eric Winter's cross-country course. And the first, I'm sure a man you know well, Sam Griffiths with Happy Times. Went to the World Games in Kentucky last year. Didn't go well there, but a very good four-star combination. Yeah, well proven this horse uh, and Sam, very experienced. Um, he was unlucky, he had a, quite a nasty fall at Kentucky last year. But uh, this is this is a one level lower. This is three star. Kentucky was 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 probably four star. Um, so it shouldn't prove too much of a problem for Sam and going well at this early part of the course. Big wide ox are there. Yes, he really has had a very good year. He was fourth at Badminton to remedy the problems in Kentucky. And back in 2009, third at both Badminton and Burley Mark. So some serious performances at the highest level. Exactly, and it doesn't really show there, but you've pulled up quite a steep hill to that uh, big wide table at the top and then steeply downhill to this next combination. Um, you have to get the horses well back because you've got to jump quite an upright table there, turn five strides, skinny brush. He does that really well. Now this horse owned by Dina Posford and Juliet Donald. Just having a little bit of a discussion there, Mark. Yeah, well, he's, he obviously you know, saw his stride to that fence and realised he had to sort of just make a bit of a check and uh, the horse is keen at this early part of the course, wants to get on with it and uh, wasn't really listening. Now he has to get him back for this double of corners. Very influential fence this. Three strides between the two corners makes it look really easy. I'm sure we'll see some uh, problems a little there a little bit later on in the day. Yes, yeah, Sam, who won the World Cup qualifier at Chatsworth with Happy Times last year, also won Samur, the big three-star in France, in 08. And some very good jumps there, Mark, over more straightforward fences on this Hartbury course. Yeah, now he comes down to the, to the water here. Very acute angle over that first part. One stride in over a hanging log. Then you've got to do a little S-bend there and over the skinny part of the brush there. And Mark, questions come out thick and fast there. There's a lot for the horse and the rider to quickly assess. Yeah, and you see like Sam, he, he slipped his reins to go into the water, didn't have time to get them back for the skinny brush, and then straight away you're down to a big wide ditch. And Mark, the time notoriously hard to get here at Hartbury, and we just saw how quickly Sam was going. Yeah, well, these, these three-star courses, you've just got to put your foot down right from the start. Um, you know, you can't afford just to sort of take it easy for the first part if you want to be competitive and get anywhere near the time. Well, now a very good test of that 6.19 optimum time because Caroline Powell, the Burley champion of 2010 with Lenamore, and part of your team, bronze market, WEG, starts off with Boston Tutep and a very fast lady across the country. Yes, Carolyn, she's, she's developed into a really top uh, uh, eventing rider.